Race two start here. Um, again, the wind has moved. Wow, we just got another right shift here. Uh, this is this is going to be interesting. Um, obviously, with this right shift, everybody's going to be over at the uh, committee boat end. Uh, we're at the pin boat, uh, the pin end, and uh, I'm getting the feeling that's going to be very lonely here. Again, light, probably seven knots of breeze here, um, and we'll see. Um, we'll see how. Um, we'll try to look for a 108. Oh, there they are. Uh, they're actually again uh, starting in the middle of the uh, middle of the line. Um, they are in fourth position right now. Uh, but again, as uh, the fleet goes upwind, the breeze is building, um, and the basically you can see speeds building. Again, I mean, with these right shifts, it's, it's so difficult to get a square course here. Um, it looks like at this point, 4120 may actually make this uh, in one go. 4120, I believe, is De Frenzel and Da Capo. That's Wasabi right behind them in the green. Um, and you can see that it's, it's really cool to watch the speed build on, on 108. Uh, they're getting into a little bit of a knock up here. Um, again, making it a lot of fun, I'm sure, for the uh, crews trying to figure out what's going on with the breeze. Um, we're going to go to the windwind mark and see what's going on there. One thing I would say is if you look at the leech on the Genoa, I don't know if you can uh, see it from there. If there is a leech sign, you really want to tighten that up. One other thing I would say on 108 is roll tacks don't seem to be uh, very rolly, so to speak. Um, that's definitely one thing to watch out for, especially in such light breeze where every little extra oomph you can get out of attack is going to be very beneficial. Uh, again, Dave Frenzel in the lead on Da Capo. Um, 4119 uh, hot at his heels, but I think they've kind of, uh, well, that's Mike Cannon on 4119, Wasabi. Um, he actually uh, has slowed down just a little bit. He, he was a little closer to Dave uh, on the windward leg. Um, and uh, we're right at the uh, windward mark now, so um, hopefully we'll get some carnage and uh, blood and gore uh, on tape. All right, Dave Frenzel rounding. Oh, somebody forgot to put the guy in the clip. Topper on and uh, hoisting uh, right at the uh, gate here, uh, at the uh, offset, I'm sorry. Again, Wasabi in second. Um, I think boats will find that they can probably hoist right at the windward mark if they have enough time to set up. All right, so that's 355, pole sticking out. Uh, yep, there you go, squash it forward. Um, and that's Bob Perry on uh, 572 in third, rounding in third. I don't think you guys can see anything from the sun here. 108 is rounding in fourth. And that's 3760, which is John Dexter's boat in uh, fifth place. Tim O'Day in sixth. And that's Adam Berry in seventh. That's a hoist on Blue Jay, which is actually probably one of the better hoists we've seen. Uh, kites up, filled, and as it's filling, uh, Jenny is coming down. Um, All right, uh, race one, uh, race two, uh, first rounding. Um, this is the boat in third place, 3760. Again, I apologize with the names. Kite is unfortunately stuck, uh, which is a real shame. These guys did a really good job this race. Uh, that's John Powers rounding right behind them. We moved the gates up so they're a little more even now, and you can uh, you can tell the fleet's actually more divided. Uh, so 108 is in fifth place, I believe, right now. Uh, they're doing. Uh, the, the, they're actually right down there. I don't know if you can see them. Dave Bryan has moved up a couple of spots here, going for the same gate he's uh, rounded all day.
That's 760, um, which is uh, Les Beckwith. Um, and that's Adam Berry calling for Wade Up. And right behind them is 5144. Again, they, they, they had an issue with their kite on another, on another race as well, taking it down. It's stuck up there. Um, and that is Russ Hancock's boat, but I don't think he's driving today. Looking over here, who do we have here? Um, okay, so a couple of things here. I do believe hiking out like that is a not legal. Uh, I'm actually definite that it's not legal. Um, again, a little too late on the douse here. Um, this boat is Isis, and uh, Malcolm Geffner normally drives that boat. And then we have racing class here with uh, Blondie driving. I'd watch out. And uh, Santos are dry, uh, rounding as well. Thank you. 